Hi everyone and welcome back to the happy heart. I'm so glad that you guys came over today to see this shopping haul. I am getting ready to go to youth camp with our church and the youth group. I'm one of the chaperones. Yes, I am that old. Can you believe? Time flies, I'm telling you. But um, thus I needed some stuff for myself and I needed some stuff because my son is being very well taken care of in um, two different places. And so I had to get some meals ready and prepared and um, so I needed to go shopping. So I went to Walmart and I spent about $180 and it fills up my table, but I will show you guys what I bought. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I upload content about three times a week and as fast as I can make it, I upload it to you. So first of all, look at this cutest bird ever. That is a book that he bought with his allowance. So he's hanging out in here while I show you guys the haul. So it pretty much fills up my table, but I'll kind of go over everything. So to start off, I had to get a couple different food items. I actually got a cereal just because I was craving cereal. <laughs> so I got some Special K. That is my favorite, favorite cereal of all time. I got some frosted mini wheats because that just looked good in the store. I bought some corn tortillas because we were out last taco night, so I wanted to have those on hand. Um, I really got spaghetti because this is like my child's favorite. And I've just recently tried this sauce. I've seen it hauled in a whole bunch of different Costco hauls. Um, unfortunately, I did not see it at my Costco, but it has, it has really become my new favorite. I always get thin spaghetti. I have no idea why, but I like it a lot better than the regular spaghetti. Um, I got these for my child while I was gone for like quick uh, little lunches because somebody is gonna come uh, watch him. So I didn't wanna make it too hard on her. All these paper products are going to our local shelter. Uh, this week was the week that we go and serve dinner at the shelter. We usually do it every other week and I usually bring food but because I'm gonna be out of town I um, told them I would bring paper products so I got napkins uh, plates um, I got paper towels because I thought you know what this is something they probably don't have there all the time um, I went ahead and grabbed a box of straws because I felt like that was maybe something that that is like a luxury item that they don't have there all the time got silverware and cups. I went ahead and grabbed these for my child. I just grabbed some goldfish and one of them has the Incredibles on it because he's obsessed with that. And I went ahead and grabbed um, some bread for peanut butter and jelly. I told you guys that I'm going with the youth group um, to like a camp. So I thought a sleeping bag would be in order for that. And I didn't have one, so. But don't you love this color? I really liked this darker color instead of just the regular red. I actually have a rock star because I needed to get some cash back and you could only get a certain amount. And so I waited in line again, got a rock star, got more cash back, so I was good to go. I found this beach towel. This is a picture of it. I didn't think it was too bad of a price considering. I really thought it would be good almost as like a throw to sit down. I heard at this youth camp that in the afternoons that you kind of just can hang out and kind of watch you're mostly watching over the kids so I thought this would be really good to take with me I can throw it in my backpack and then if I want to sit under a tree or something like that it would be an easy thing because it's kind of like a blanket even though it's supposed to be a beach blanket or a beach towel and this was kind of my, some of my travel stuff I wanted to get. I went ahead and got a thing of wipes just in case. I got some Clorox wipes just in case. Went ahead and grabbed a pack of Q-tips and a first aid kit. And I'm going to keep this in my backpack when I'm doing stuff with them. I went ahead and grabbed some flossers just because they were in this little pack and I thought that would be convenient. Um, I needed a new toothbrush and I just thought I'd grab this one to tide me over. I definitely needed some dry shampoo because who knows, I've never been to this camp before so I just grabbed a small one so I wouldn't have to take my really large dry shampoo. 
And then I got two sets of shampoo and conditioner and some body wash to take with me. So because I have thick hair, I didn't know if just one of these would be enough, so I grabbed two different ones. I went ahead and grabbed two hand towels because, um, gosh, do we always need hand towels? But I felt like mine were looking kind of raggedy, and so I just wanted to freshen up my at least my guest bathroom. So I grabbed two of these. I think they're actually considered silver. Um, they weren't a terrible price or anything. I am usually a Calgon girl by, by nature, and so this is kind of like bath salt type of a thing that you put in the bath, it dissolves. And I love the Calgon brand. For some reason they only had Dr. Teal or they had the Equate brand. So I thought, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and try this and see how it is. Oh, my blow dryer, let me tell you guys. I've had it forever and ever, and it was a Con Air, which seems cheap, but I loved it, and I loved the way it blew dry my hair, and I actually have another one, and I feel like even on low, it blows too hard, and it mats up my hair. So if you have thick hair or hair that's prone to tangling, you can totally understand this. So I got a very similar one to what I had last time. The only difference I was really excited about is it says it's a cord keeper or retractable cord, which if you know and you use a blow dryer every day, you know how those cords get. So I'm excited about this and hopefully it will be good. I went ahead and grabbed a twin fitted sheet because like I told you, we're going to this camp and I can put this on the bottom and then put my sleeping bag over it. My child went to camp last year and I felt like it was better to have a twin sheet for him because your sleeping bag kind of slides all over on those mattresses. So I thought this will be perfect because I'll use it and then when he goes to camp, he can use this same twin sheet. So you can't go wrong with that. Um, I actually looked at water bottles all over. Um, I was in a really nice store looking at them, almost bought a Yeti one. And this is the Ozark water bottle. And so I bought this. Um, I'm hoping, crossing my fingers, that it is good, but I thought I really liked this color and I'm gonna try it. Um, I went ahead and grabbed a few clothing items. So I grabbed some Capri pants and these are by the, these are by the True You brand. And I really liked um, these Capris, they were stretchy. Um, I really like these new shirts that they have from True You. I got kind of a purplish pink one before and so I was excited about that. This is a kind of a different type of a shirt from True You, but I thought I just needed some plain shirts and I thought that would be good. I actually grabbed this really cute, I don't know if you guys can tell, it's like denim colored spaghetti strap shirt and I thought this would be really good for summer, especially when it gets crazy hot. So that is it for my shopping haul. I spent about $180. Um, I did buy this all at Walmart and it was just basically to help me get ready to go, some filler items and um, stuff to have different people take care of my child while I was away. So, you know, just stuff you need. So, hope you guys enjoy. I'm always curious about what people buy, so I love sharing that with you guys. And I will see y'all in my next brand new video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and those bell notifications and stay tuned for my TJ Maxx haul that I also bought today. Bye!